Hi everyone, this is Jack from Visual Paradigm. In the next few minutes, I will show you how you can learn the project management lifecycle yourself with the help of the Guide Tour feature. Before I talk about the Guide Tour, let's have a quick overview of the project management lifecycle first. This is the project management lifecycle. It consists of five phases. Identification, initiation, planning, execution and control, and close out. I can double click on the phase to open it. In each phase, there are many activities. Each activity requires you to perform some steps. You read the instruction, view the sample, and perform the action required. Very often, this involves form filling and drawing diagrams. There are many activities and steps in the five phases. To help you understand how things work at a particular point in time, a guide tour was developed. The guide tour provides you with a case study in understanding and experiencing the IT project management life cycle. You can take a glance off and learn the process with the help of the pre-populated fields and pre-developed diagrams. And you can try the feature without worrying about messing up your production works. Let me show you how it works. To open the guide tour, select ITSM from the toolbar. Then, click on the Open Guide Tour button. Select the tour. In this demonstration, I'm going to show you the guide through process of project management life cycle. There are four levels of complexity, which is determined by answering a questionnaire in an activity under the second phase. In this demonstration, I just select the high complexity option. You click OK to open. The application will restart itself. I'm now in a completely different environment. And this project doesn't contain any of the production data. I can try the guide through process by opening the first phase. Open the first activity. Perform the action by filling in the project description here. Try to play around, and perhaps to enter the business objectives here. You don't need to worry about polluting your work because, as I said, it's a completely different project. And when you finish, you go back and complete the step. The form data is restored to the default data provided by the case study. If you want to try again, click the Reset button here. The form is clear. The guide tour allows you to jump to any phase, any activity and even any step of the entire process. To do this, go back to the process diagram first. Click on this button. Select the phase I want to visit. Let's say I'm interested in seeing the close out phase. I select close out here and select the activity that I want to visit. And confirm. I'm brought to the close out phase, the activity reveal project shortcomings, and this step. If I go back to the process diagram, I can see the two previous activities completed. The phases before are also completed. So if I open the form, I see the data provided by the case study. I can modify the data and complete the step. Or I can end from scratch by resetting this step. As you can see, the form becomes empty. If I want to fill in the form with the default data again, click the Fill in Default Data button here. The form is filled. Of course, I can also visit the previously completed activities and view the work done.
I can also navigate back to the moment when the procurement planning was performed. When I finished learning, I can go back to the production environment by selecting ITSM from the toolbar and then exit guide tour. I'm back to the production environment. This is the end of this video. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.